What's up, Vengeance Seekers? I hope you are having a fantastic day. Welcome to the dark side, where we're jumping back into Star Wars. Cool. Did we lose our stuff on the last episode? Cal just touched on the darkness a little bit. Ooh, I enjoyed it. It was nice. And, uh, yeah, Bode tried to throw us under the bus again. Bode! So, we are currently on uh, Kobo, and we are going to align the arrays so that we can locate where uh, Bode has gone to so right. that we can track him down. We are making a train tunnel through the abyss. Yep. So join us as we uh, look to start the end of this adventure, I believe. Yeah, it's looking that way. Winded down, winded down, winding up. Hot end chatter on the comms, kid. How you doing? Just reached the control center. I'll let you know if I run into any oh, trouble. Yeah, I've been this way. Welcome. Oh, yeah, we've been here. The director of this experimental we came here by accident. Breeze, unless one of us is going to stay behind, we need someone here to activate the arrays. Oh, yeah, sure. I'll ask around. See if anyone's got a death wish. Maybe Turgle? Maybe not Turgle. Maybe not Turgle. Yeah. Um, if any of you saw our live play of this uh, game, you would have seen us go into this place and absolutely do nothing because there was nothing to do at the time. Totally by fluke that we found this place. Oh, Keep moving, yeah. buddy. Because we were like, hey, all these screens need to be lit up. Yep. Show. Your mind, traitor. Already on it. Oh. Now, get this. Chase the traitor. Now, get the scratch. Lightsabers cool and all, but look at their electric work. But also look at their death. <laughs> yeah. Imagine you wielding that electric work. Dare you get your shield back? Have you seen your automatic do dodge yet? Oh, I keep forgetting I have that. Okay. Oh, is this enough? I thought that the, that the other guys came immediately the? after this. Happened there. Whoa. Be back. Be back. Be back. Be back. He just lit that guy on fire and fire and then told Can him you not to your own dude that fire? That'd be great. He did, I think he did. That guy's shield went down so fast and he's like, not my fault. <laughs> Hit me again. He did. Yes, he did. You little masochist, you. I think it came. He thought it was coming out sarcastic, but it came out as a as a request. Yeah, it definitely did. Oh, come on, come on. Are you talking to yourself? 
Let's try to fight, man. I will not. Exploded around me. That was amazing. That door's not even opening and closing anymore. I'm not even trying. Nah. Maybe Bo told him we were coming. <laughs> Let me go. Oh no, this is not the way I came in. This looks promising. Sure. What did you say? All the arrays are online. Now we just have to activate them. Okay. Sure, sure, sure. We must have locked down the facility Hot. when they evacuate. That's not gonna stop us. Damn. I forgot about the tar roads. <laughs> I have not got a stim in a long time. Is that, am I done with stims? You may have max capacity stims. <sighs> Lame. Can't use this lift yet. Proceed to the observation deck to initiate alignment. Got a hand at the Cree. She thought of everything. Use this lift from here. What am I supposed to do? Am I taking I go out? Am hmm. I just Should we just go through the oh activate. activate. I was like, do we just go through the window? We can Here we go. Oh, triangulating. Oh that oh Z. Oh Z. this feels we made it. 
a long trip. Couldn't have been easy. I'm like 200 years old, but I'm as spry as a Padawan. <laughs> amazing. Oh, Cal, this is simply amazing. Can you start the arrays when we're in position? Oh, I stand ready for your order. It would be my honor to see Master Kree's dream alive once more. Will your master. Um, she came up there right behind us very ominously. Yeah, I thought it was going to be a bad time. Same. Yeah. All right. Marin, sweetie. <laughs> Baby doll. Let's get her up. Let's go. No. Honey buns? No, let's not do that. That's not what I meant. That's I meant not the appropriate. Ship. I meant the ship. <laughs> mm. Well, I bet you meant the ship. Anything else is none of my damn home business. Cal probably says, hey, Marin, here comes the ship coming for docking. I hope not. Nobody should ever say that. Don't ever say that. <laughs> Oof, your hood's freaking out. Hey, Marin, you good? Are you, are you a clone? Oof. Are oh you wearing a mimic hoodie? She's going to bare teeth in any second. <laughs> the ultimate defense of mimic hoodies. Take my clothes, I mm. dare you to try. We're going to the abyss, aren't we? I'm going into the abyss. Nobody's talking. Oh, Very Breeze quiet. waiting for a bumpy ride. <laughs> is he oh. standing right there? Just... <laughs> Hope Grease is still ready for a bumpy ride. That's a, that's a weird thing to, to whisper shout when you're next to somebody. <laughs> We're heading to the abyss now. Fire up the arrays. I'll be monitoring your progress from here. May the force be with you all. And you see. Oh, yeah. Oh, I see her. There she lies. This sucks. Poor griefs. Well, what do you think is taking Z so long? Dagon Gera was the only person to live through what we're about to do. At least we will die together. Optimistic. Right talk. to the end. Great pep talk. I stick that on my tombstone. <laughs> <laughs> Look. That's never good. I know, I know. You want to fly this thing? BB. He was stepping up. Yeah, I'll fly this thing. Yeah. Step over, old man. Uh, don't sass the pilot. That's how we get thrown out. <laughs> That's what all the other four saps said right before they were torn into vortex chow. Ooh. Great. Now it's an obstacle course. You got this, Grease. Too fast, but you are faster. Stop piloting and start flying. I'm rerouting power from deflectors to the engines. What are you crazy? You're trading safety for speed. Exactly. We're all in on you, buddy. You're right. It's my ship, ain't it? Crazy does it, baby. <laughs> crazy does it. It's not just you. Z, what's going on? The arrays are overloading. There's nothing I can do. What? 
We need to go faster. I'm going as fast as I can. Wait, wait a minute. Are you crazy? If you jump in a hyperspace blind, they'll be picking up pieces of the manis all over the outer rim. Do you trust me? You know I do, Cal. <laughs> Let her ride. Use the force, Cal. Yeah. <laughs> Whoa. Yeah, that's what I would do too. We made it, we're alive, good. Damn. Live to fight another day. I mean, you probably would have wanted to do that kiss before you potentially would have died, but after is good too. You survived. <laughs> well, at least none of us lost our cool. <laughs> none of us. Wow. I hope it's worth it. Looks kind of like Earth. It's like yeah, there's like a purpley Earth. <laughs> we can't go there. No. I said now. <laughs> we don't have the means, nor does it exist. That's really a shame. Uh, Although, to be fair, exist. if you believe in the multiverse theory, it could exist. It exists somewhere. Maybe somebody got this planet off their own mind. Yeah. Maybe all they've been there. Maybe we have aliens amongst the developing crews of games. Or all of the, uh, all of, all stories oh, are leaked this. through the, uh, the dimensions. Yep. You and Mara be careful out there, okay? <gasps> Mara's coming with yeah, me? Yeah, yeah, you too, BD. No, we'll all be okay, die. Grease. I'm She's not gonna die. Cal. She's gonna save Cal from dying. Yeah, and probably die day, herself. No! She's not gonna sacrifice not herself. She better not. We'll be back soon. Mara and I'd rather us die than you, okay? Let us die. <laughs> Well, then there can't be another Star Wars with Cal. Stupid. <laughs> what is she doing? I meditate. She's just like looking at me like this. Like, really? Yeah. Like, you good? Staring at me as I was mer meditating. Meritating. 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 Oh, Maybe I was marinating. Marin <laughs> marinating. Marinating. what you were expecting. I don't know what I was Get expecting. It? You're aiding Marin. So much has changed since I first heard his name. Not what I was intending, but the temple's this way. I suppose. Dagon and Centauri Cree planned their future here. And look where it got them. We're only assuming she's got, she's um, alien with human parts. We're not exactly sure how that works. I mean, they seem to make it work. It we seems... had that fade to black a couple yeah. episodes past, so they figured it out. Yeah. Oh, girl, you good? Oh, that's oh, it. It's so pretty. That's the temple. You can see the door. Oh. That's the temple that the stuff happened at. Yeah. Bode will not let this end peacefully. He has already used fatherhood to justify betrayal and murder. Now we have him cornered with nowhere else to run. He will kill or be killed. Be killed. Yep, hopefully it doesn't come to well, us. Say something. You're right. But what about Kata? She's not much younger than we were when our families were taken from us. I know. You and I will carry that loss for the rest of our lives. But Kata still has a chance. Yes, she does. Very well. We will give Bo the choice to stand down. Uh -oh. For Kata's sake. And ours. How much caught is like a prodigy Jedi or something? Comes pack on a punch. Oh. Oh, it's kind of beady. There we go. Buried in bait. Oh, yeah, this is part of the attack. I can't say what I'm thinking. What are you thinking? It's not. It's not good. That 
God, it won't survive. Well, I mean, that's one way to avoid people coming after you for revenge. Oh, oh, it's Marin. <laughs> I keep thinking about um, something. I think Kata will said. survive. I think. I think it's Disney, so yes, but like. I think Cal will mercy. There's so much hatred towards Bode. Seer won her battle with the dark side. You will too. Not kill him, but not um. Allow him to walk freely. I guess. He'll be restrained. Fall back to the temple. The Nile are enveloping our position. Master Gera, that is an order. What do you grow here for food, though? Eat the trees, I guess. Is there happen. stuff inside that's, like, growing? Mm, looks like you got some, uh, some crystals, some... Maybe... Do you hear that? Bioluminescent moss. Stuff's glowing. I heard Kata. It's got water at least. But can you drink the water? Kata's singing. I'm just not yeah, okay with that's, it. <laughs> that's unsettling. It's really unsettling. Girl, you need to stop. Oh, look, at those might be plants you can eat. Plants you can destroy. There's not a lot of food on this on this planet, but you know, let's destroy, destroy those the little plants. I thought that's how I got the seeds, but I guess not. <laughs> well, if this was real, you would have just <laughs> cut, cut in off her. <laughs> yep. She'd be in half right now. <laughs> Sorry, Bob Marin. Oh, good. <clears throat> this is like walking into one of those scary games and you walk into a house and all you hear is singing of a child. Yeah, and you're like, this is gonna go bad. That door is gonna shut behind me and we're gonna have a bad time. I'm haunted by a child. It's like in our one shot where you're facing. Yeah. Oh, baby oh. likes her. Baby one. Hey, Katza. This is Marin. She's a friend. I'm sorry Papa hurt you. Yeah. He said I'd never see you again. What are you doing here? Kata, your father stole something very important. We're gonna ask him to give it back. Will you show us the way? Okay. Follow me. I don't like it here. It's dark and lonely. You don't have to be afraid. Better? <laughs> You're very pretty. Oh. Okay, Marin doesn't know how to deal with human emotions. You're a good girl. <laughs> she thought she probably thought that was very nice, but did not know how to say that. <laughs> yeah. How did you get here? It wasn't easy. You shouldn't have followed us. Papa, don't! Stay back, Kata. This is the only way to keep you safe. She will be safe. I promise, Bode. But listen to me. It's over. Lay down your weapons. This planet will be a haven for those hunted by the Empire, including Kata and you. 
But you have to surrender. Now. Go outside, Kata. Oh, no. Listen to them, please. Two. A. Jerk. B. You're stronger than I gave you credit for. Best for my family. It's going too dark. Bigger. He was, yeah, he was dark before. Oh, I don't think he's dark. He's gone too dark. This is. You have turned her away. You have turned her against me, levels. Don't you dare! Don't you even. Distract him! I will strike from the shadows. Oh! oh Jerk! Bomb. Yeah. I like that he's using the stamps that you could have used had you been not so vehemently against the, the gun. Yeah. At least we know what it looks like. It looks like. There you go. The only time you'll see it. So as I said, vehemently against. <laughs> I get there's probably Jedi that used it. It's just, to me, it's not Jedi. It's like a knight using something other than a sword. <laughs> it's like a knight bringing a gun to a sword fight? Yeah. Um, yeah, totally. And that's the beauty about video games, that they have some chances that you get to choose what you like. There's no the one right way. Yeah, or classes. Yeah. No, it's not over. That was... Saved by Marin. Woo! I get to fly! Thanks, Marin. Oh, oh cool! Marin, Next a, platform. You're such a babe. Oh, that's right. I'm sorry. Did I not mention that I went to the dark side a little bit? Good to know that our dark our dark side powers do not work on him. Hey BD. Can't seem to blast those back, hey? Nope, those ones are can't. In close range. That seems really hard to dodge. So it's that one. Stay away from Kata. Again, he got me. Constant attack. Yeah. Oh, new one. Good, good, good. Oh, I couldn't even deflect that one? Doesn't seem like you can even dodge that. This is the final boss battle? I don't know.
could be, but I don't know. It's a tough one. I could totally see it being it, like the, the whole story leading up to this. Totally. It kind of seems weird to see the last one because there's just no. Master Alcides, please. He has the will to fight. It seems like there should be. And I admire it, but it is not only his life we would risk. The ships are leaving. There is no time. I suggest you both join us. I think he was. I will strike from the shadows. He would have eaten. Well, he puts the bomb on her. Did he? Yeah, oh, and then she sad. phases through and it drops. He doesn't go with her. Oh, must be nice, Marin. <laughs> I could really use that ability. That's what I was like. I'm like, oh, he doesn't. Make, like, she doesn't. Ex like, he must not be putting a bomb on her. She doesn't explode them. So if it's not see. just a race feature, can you teach me that? Yeah. <laughs> Have me looking at how to explore where she was. You suck. You suck. I feel like... Smash! Grant will be right. She came up in that edge with us. Yeah, because she just starts doing her own thing. Hey, BD. That move. Yeah, where's our bomb that we can put on people's chests? I dodged that. Oh crap. really just use Marin like holding him down instead of just like disappearing. Yeah, that that's not offered to you, Pain. Like again, like he's so fast. He's got such cool moves too, like no, my dude. <clears throat> Somehow he's like Pick on one. her and then on me. I mean, I guess a little Jedi sense, but such an annoying trait. I don't think, I don't know if blocking him's gonna do it because he's got so many red moves. Mm -hmm. Unblockable moves, that's tough. Yeah. Thanks, Marin. One eternity later. Hey, you know what? It's real. It's ratchet. Yeah. It's real bad. It's the worst fight of the game, anyways. I'm done with it. No, totally. And it's it's the dynamics are not there. No. They should have spent more time on this fight. 
Not to mention the whole story at this point in time just makes less sense. Like the whole bone thing is. I don't know why he's the last enemy. I get what he did, but. Yeah, totally. Like have it be a thing, sure. But like the final fight. Yeah. Like, what is his motivation? Well, you know his motivations, but. But like the final boss of this game. Yeah. Like this is where the story was coming to. The guy that was just protecting his kid. Like Dagan. Dang, three fights we had against Dang, and they were all epic. Yeah, Ravis. Ravis? <clears throat> yeah, Ravis. Ravis was awesome. That was such a fun fight. Such a good fight. It was tough, but it wasn't relentless. It wasn't broken. Yeah. You understood his moveset. You didn't have to worry about your combo not breaking. Oh, come on. My anger with the game is strong. Totally. The other thing that doesn't make sense too is like the other game, Fallen Order, you had this climactic buildup and the end fight was Darth Vader. That was your end fight. It was amazing. You didn't get to win the fight, you just had to escape, which is perfectly reasonable. Darth Vader's a beast. Mm -hmm. But in this one, you see Vader for one fight, he kills Seer, and that's all you see him for. And then you're left fighting him. Yeah, exactly. Who has no aspirations to do anything horrible, technically. No, he's just like, hey, I want this plan. You're like, we can flip and share it. Yeah. Why, like, why are we having, why are we fighting about this? Our fight is supposed to be with the Empire. We're fighting a guy who's not really going to do it. Yeah, like, sure, stole the compass. That sucks. Yeah. Killed some people. That sucks, too. Horrible. Horrible. But murder's like, murder. Murder's murder. But we've murdered a bunch of people too. And like, I just why is he so against them being there? Yeah. Like that was never explained. Like, you can't just give this place to these people. Like, we're not just get, we're yeah, what? Explain it. Get, what is his reasoning? What? Why doesn't he like these people? Why can't they go there? Why are like it's not risking anybody? Why is he get so bent against it? He's like, this was for your family and my family. Cal's like, this is our family. <laughs> but yeah, they're just they're, his motivations weren't clear enough. We understand some of them. I just don't feel like he was fleshed out enough. No, yeah, I agree. The combat being as broken as it is, when you cannot break a move set to block, and you are stuck in a like me as a person, I can see that I need to block, and I'm trying to block by pushing the button. Mm -hmm. As a Jedi. If they really existed, I'm pretty sure he would know when to block faster than I would. Yeah. So the fact that I can't break my own combo to save my life is ridiculous. Yeah, and the fact that your auto dodge is not working. There it is. So that's what's supposed to happen. Chasing me. I know there's like a bunch of perks that I haven't unlocked either. There's a whole bunch of perks. And there's other stuff I could do, but you should not need it to make the end fight that competitive. No, because a lot of people don't want to do that stuff. No. They, want to they do, want the story. They want the story. They want to do all the extra running around collecting nonsense. Yeah, yeah it's because it's just... What you Arbitrary. It means nothing to the end. Mm -hmm. And it's just monotonous at times. Yeah, you headbutt him, Cal. Stick it in his butt. That went too long. <laughs> 
Me too. Yeah, sure. I mean, I wouldn't want a lightsaber up there, that's for sure, but... You know. Maybe he's got one of those metal butts that can't be hurt by a lightsaber. Maybe, maybe. Who am I to judge? On your daughter. Claude, we know what it's like to grow up alone. Please listen to them, Papa. All right. And when the Empire comes, will you be able to protect my little girl? <laughs> I'm sorry, Kata. I tried. Oh, you do anything to merit and this game gets a zero out of ten. The dark side. Good shot, Marin. Sure. Mm -hmm. Well, my theory of, well, he was going to give him mercy. I was initially right, but then Bo got stupid. That was cold, though. That was cold. Yeah. I mean, in that state of mind, he was probably like, you tried to kill Marin. Oh, yeah, totally. I was yeah. what I would have done. Yeah, but... I would have done the same thing. I'm sorry, but you, in my life, your daughter that I just met comes dead last. Mm -hmm. Oh, poor kid, Bo. Stupid dad. Stupid dad. Like, he wasn't a bad guy. It's just nonsensical. Yeah. Even as a dark Jedi Sith, whatever you want to call him. How are you feeling? Better. Thanks. Good. We should speak. I was not much older than you. When I lost my family. For many years I carried this pain. I did not want to feel better. Why? I thought if I let go of the pain, I would be letting go of the people I love. But I was wrong. And one day, I met someone who also lost his family. Damn it, keep the lightsaber. Together, we found another way to survive. This pain is yours. It is part of you. When my mother died, changed papa and me too i guess yes but it does not have to define you and you must not let it consume you We brought their bodies with us. Mm -hmm. Yeah. 
they they sort of briefly touched on that, but they put it in. That's Marin. Oh, look up look up the actress who plays Marin. She's a babe. I wanted to see if uh, Marin's likeness was like hers. That is, a lot of the characters seem to keep the likeness of their voice actors. Yeah. Except yeah. for Greaves. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Bo looks like Bo. Mm hmm Like, still stupid. Like, your wife is dead. And instead of ta like, being there for your daughter, you go and you go on a suicide mission. Yeah, you're like, I'm gonna die. awful that you made a deal with the Empire to keep your daughter safe that you would do anything for them and the chance comes to be with your daughter and you give that up for a fight because you don't want anybody else to be there which so is you, stupid <laughs> you've now abandoned her instead of holding the truth of being with her that you said before you'd rather align with the Empire than align with people who are going to help you succeed. Exactly. And like, your daughter's gonna grow up and I think she's gonna want more company than just your ass. Exactly. You guys are gonna be here alone. That's what I was thinking earlier. Like, you're gonna be here alone. Heck that. If I had to be stuck with, if I had to be stuck with my dad, I love my dad, but if I had to be stuck on a plan with him, I'd probably throw myself off a cliff. Yeah. No offense. Dad. Like I said, the last game had this epic conclusion where you went up against Vader. I wanted to build off of that. And like, again, I don't know if there's some lore around Cal being an actual character in the universe and maybe he never fought Vader again. Maybe, yeah. But it just seems... But our best friend being Final Boss? Final yeah. Oh, I missed what he said. Let me walk my own path. When I needed to. Taught me what it truly means to be a Jedi. Now you're gone. We will continue your legacy, Seer. We will build something that can outlast the Empire. I promise you that. I promise. I'm scared. Totally. I almost lost myself. I don't know if I'm ready. I don't know if I'm ready for what comes next. That's fair. That's valid. the end yep so yeah 
I don't know if there's going to be another game because I don't think this one's going to hit very well with a lot of people. I don't think the story's going to hit well. Do you remember when we were first playing this game and it first came out and everybody was talking so much shit about it? Mm -hmm. And we were like, no, it's fine. Like, I don't see what the big deal is. Mm -hmm. I see what the big deal is. I, I, I get it. I, get, I, it I get the ending. Totally. It, it, oh, there's so much promise. This. There's Yeah, there's, again. <laughs> when I looked up Bodakuna, and it does, from what I can tell, it doesn't seem like he has any place in the universe up until this game. Um, there's some backstory fine. on him and stuff he's done, but I think it may have came from the game. But if he's a new character, there wasn't enough about him to make me... Yes. I don't know. You want to introduce new characters? You want to have them be a big part of the story? Okay, yeah. cool, cool, cool. Great. I love I love new characters. I love new, new lore. Give that to me. But don't make that the final battle and have it be as janky as it was. <laughs> like, there was no reason that we played the whole game on the third toughest level. Like... Like level one, two, yeah. three. On night, I think it is. Yeah. And we had to go down to level one to face this guy because it took us two hours. Yeah, well, I mean, it was that. It was just, it was frustrating. It was, was frustrating. frustrating. And again, it's mostly that you can't, you can't back out of a combo once you're in a combo. Mm -hmm. And you get hit one time on these higher level playthroughs and it just dings you so badly in your power meter. Mm -hmm. So, yeah. Yeah, which is unfortunate because the rest of the game was so good. Like, up until yeah. this point. And I really was hoping that, like, this is not going to be game of the year. It's not. There's no way this is game of the year in any aspect. No. It was good with Dagon. The Dagon fights were awesome. Those were fun. The yeah. Ravis fight was so much fun. So good. It was tough. But once you started to learn his principal moves, you had a chance to beat him. Yeah. And we didn't have to regress our, our uh, difficulty in order to beat him. No, it was good. It was it was good, tough, good. Yeah, even it if it wasn't was good, janky broken still. It wasn't bad, broken, bad. Yeah, you still couldn't like back out of your combos to defend yourself. Like I said before, as a Jedi, he should be able to predict a maneuver faster than I would. So if I'm pressing the circle button to back out because I know I'm going to get hit, you know a Jedi is going to be like, oh, I need to get out of here faster than me would. Yeah, and I know we're giving this game a lot of shit, but like... I mean, good aspects are it was beautiful. I think there wasn't enough worlds to explore. I think there could have been more worlds. I felt this game was too short, story-wise. Yeah, I felt it was too short, too rushed. But also, I we're seeing a, a theme this year with games where like over the course of a game, it gets progressively worse and less cared for. Like, the beginnings are amazing and so much fun, and, like, the story and the dynamics are great, and then slowly the, all of that just kind of starts to drop off. We saw it with Forspoken. We saw it with Redfall. Yeah, Cameron Monaghan. Mm -hmm. I am a fan of his acting. Yeah. I've watched him in uh, Gotham. Gotham. Mm -hmm. In, uh, what was that one? Uh, I honestly haven't seen him in anything, so it's nothing I've watched. He played, oh, it's... He was on was. Netflix. I can't remember. He's on Gotham. He was really good. I think he's a great, a good actor, mm -hmm. good voice actor. I think he did well in this game, but I think that they didn't do him justice in this game. Yeah, they didn't stretch him at all, which is fine. Like if if you've got a stoic character, great. Um, that's that that was that's that's minor for but, me. I guess like three good things about the game. I would say some of the uh, a lot of the. The graphics, the worlds, they looked really nice. They looked really good. The graphics in the worlds were really cool. Some of the dynamics, some of the puzzles were really cool. Yeah, some of that was good. Um, we never really delved into the side missions too much. Just, there wasn't a pull for it because a lot of the side missions you're just getting like, minor things that you can need. Yeah, and there was not a lot of extra story. You're not like finding out about this person and this person and this person. Like, no. Not doing the this person. I love the right characters. Now. The characters were good. Like Marin. Marin's uh, amazing. Yeah. Seer was always good from the first game. Grease was good from the first game. Marin was, you know, she was a little more unknown in the first game. Um, Z. Z was cool. Who else was there? Doma. Doma. The initial meeting of Doma was cool, but there was nothing after that. Where... Yeah, they should have expanded on that a bit more. Like, they could have expanded so much. There's There was so much potential for world building. She sounded so badass in the beginning, and then after that, she was just a merchant. Yeah, which is unfortunate, because there, there was just so much so much cause for, like for there was so much potential for expansion in the yeah. world and in the lore and um the third thing was that fight against the drill that was cool 
where you're flying through the air through the little stuff and you're attacking <gasps> the drill. That's right with Marin. That was cool. That was a cool fight. That I was loved really that. Cool that was fight. very innovative. I enjoyed doing that fight. Yeah. I wish that fight had lasted longer than it did, but it was super cool. Uh, three things I didn't like were the combat. Uh, Bode's storyline, how this game ended, did not like that. I mean, I understood some of his story. I liked how his story could have been really good. Yeah. Like, realistically, they could have ended it when we found Seer dead. And they could have ended the game there and had that be the final fight. Yeah. And then expanded more on the story in a se in another yeah. game. Because, yeah, it just kind of... It, it took away from the first fight in Fallen Order where Cal went up against Vader. And he was no match for Vader. But this could have been the time where he was more of a match, but still not on that level. Yeah, and totally. then you could lead into another game where he is almost there, but he never, obviously he never kills Vader. Obviously. Um, and I think the third thing that I didn't like was the skill tree was too similar to the first game. Okay. That's, I, yeah, I didn't, I've never seen anything about the first game. Yeah, so. the first game, it just seemed too similar. It didn't seem there's any, like, incredible variation from the first game that would have been better i guess so um i really liked the story progression with uh marin and cal love that i love me a good love story mm, <laughs> it's my favorite thing and i i just i really love that i really really enjoyed that one um another thing i really liked was the cool ways that bd expanded where we were mm -hmm. like using the foam and, we, and then we were using the I did like, that, like yeah. those puzzles yeah, yeah that was cool where BD it became like an important integral part to figuring some of this stuff out mm -hmm. um, again I would have liked to have maybe some of those techniques that he learned to help in those puzzles be useful in a fight totally that would have been so cool and even if not in this game the next game expanded yeah. on totally yeah because he learned all these things but you can only use them in puzzles but if you could just be like if it triggers a quick time event where you're like, BD, do this, and then you have the enemy grappled or something. Shoot that old goo in his eyeball. Or electrocute him. Or electrocute him, yeah. So he's, like, stunned. Um, totally. Yeah. That would have been so cool. Um, but yeah, I think overall, the game is okay. Would I pay full price for this knowing now? Knowing them what I know now? No. Yeah. Um, if the game had ended after we found Seer and Cordova and we're like, we're going to Tantalor... I would have given this probably a 7 out of 10. Maybe even an 8 out of 10. Yeah, back then, probably yeah, up, up to an 8. Up to an 8 out of 10, yeah. Now, probably 6 at most. A 6 at most. I, I would go for 5.5, maybe. I would go for 5. I, I'd go for a 6, because it has redeeming quality. It's just, there were parts that just needed to be fine-tuned more, and both story needed to have more depth. Yeah. More than it, the quick five, the quick, um, not five, quick uh, cutscenes that we got where little information was given. And even, like, there's a moment where we took control of Seer to fight Vader. Mm -hmm. Why could we not take control of Bode in a past, in a, like a, a back, what do you call it? Um, flashback? Flashback. And, and see some of his life and what he went through and why he developed this way and what his mindset was when he became this way. Totally. Even while he was, like, doing that monologue to, to Cal where he was like, this is what happened, this is what we did. Yeah. Give us, give us a reason to understand him. Give us the understanding of why he's doing what he's doing. But he just, he was never, he was never a villain. No. He, we always knew he was going to turn, mm -hmm. but he was never a villain. Yeah. And, like, it just didn't make sense. Like, why couldn't the hidden path go there? Yeah. Like, why, 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 why did that, that hinder your safety? Like, why... Why was saving others and having safety around your child in that example worse than you guys going there by yourselves where your child had nobody and nothing? That's trauma. Imagine growing up on a desolate planet with nothing but your own father. No, thank you. And no way to get out of there. No therapy. No <laughs> therapist. Yeah. Nobody to talk to but yourself and your father. And to, 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 I get he loved his kid. Totally, yeah. But he was blind in the way to love her properly. Yeah, it's that it's that whole adage. Have you ever heard that where you, where it's like, yeah, sure, you'd die for your kids, of course. Mm -hmm. But would you live for your kids? Yeah, and he chose to die for his kid instead of live for his kid when the alternative would have benefited him and his kid. Yeah, would have been better for her too.
So, I mean, that's our thoughts. Um, that's what your guys, thoughts were. Yeah, you guys I'd probably have different it. thoughts. We'd love to hear your sides, your yeah. takes. Comment below what you thought. Give us theories. Your... Give us everything. Lore that we might have missed that we didn't know about. Yeah, Give I, me the lore. Like I love I say, it when I, you guys comment new lore. It's my favorite thing when you're like, go here. I'm like, yes. I looked up Bode. I didn't see any information on him that he's actually in the Star Wars universe. But if he is, please let us know and give us some details and yeah even if it has nothing to do with this game or like if it's the smallest little like leap to tell us something else tell us everything mm -hmm. i love it just comment mm -hmm. away and hopefully we can get back and get some insight from all of you and yeah just like what do you what did you think what um give us your devil's advocate to our points yeah yeah argue with us let us let us yeah <laughs> totally give be like in no, it was a, a nice game. way in don't a nice be way. a jerk okay you're going to be a jerk. You're going to go bye-bye. We keep it friendly here. We keep it nice. Yes. It's a positive environment, so you're welcome to come devil's advocate, but yeah. keep it positive. A uh, little devil's advocate is always good for brain expansion. Exactly. So that is the end of Star Wars Jedi Survivor. I am not going to be doing anything extra in this game. That last fight really took it out of me for this game. Yeah, it took us almost three hours, guys. Like yeah. It was... So we're going to move on from this game into some other stuff. Hope you guys enjoyed the playthrough and we hope you come back for all the ones in the future. Yeah, we'll see you there. Just, well, not exactly what we expected, mm. but this place is our home now. Yeah, Grease. Yeah, I guess it is. Still got a lot of work ahead. It will take time to contact the hidden path. And find the anchorites. And build a saloon. I mean, the place is creepy, but it does have franchise potential. I love him so funny. This belongs with you. It belongs with all of us. What do you think, kid? Should we give it a shot? Yeah. Let's do it. Okay. Oh, that's the spirit! Oh, that's great. Come on, I'll bet you're hungry. I'll make you something to eat. Did you ever have a scar stick?